Hi and welcome to Outwell and to the Montana 4E from our deluxe collection. This is a good size family tent which is tunnel in design. We have the bedrooms at the back and then a really good sized living space at the front which we'll show you in detail shortly. First of all though I'd like to start off with some features on the outside. So starting off with our fly sheet. This is our Outex 4000 material. It's a good quality taffeta polyester which you would expect to last for a good long time. It's been uh, fully PU coated on the inside and then all of the seams throughout the tent have been fully taped to ensure that it's completely waterproof with a hydrostatic head of 4000 millimetres. So even in heavy rainfall, it should stay nice and dry inside the tent. The frame that we use on here is a bit of a combination actually of steel and of fibreglass. So we use a fibreglass pole at the front to create this canopy and then at the back there's another fibreglass pole as well. And then the main body of the tent is made up of these steel poles here, making it really solid and stable even in high wind conditions. The fibreglass poles that we use are a little bit different to standard fibreglass as we have a protective sheath around the outside of these, making them just that little bit stronger uh, again in high wind conditions. So this is our Duratec fibreglass. When it comes to setting the tent up, you should find it nice and simple as well because we colour code all of the sleeves to match the poles. So you shouldn't really get the wrong pole in the wrong place here. Uh, some other nice features that we use here is uh, our wind stabiliser system. So I'll just show you how this works. We have these Velcro straps here, so when it comes to setting the tent up, we simply wrap these around the poles, and you'll find there's one at the top and at the bottom of all of the poles around the tent. This is then where we have our guy line attached, so when we take the guy line out and peg it into position, it pulls all of the fabric against the frame of the tent, making it much more taut and therefore much more stable. In fact, we have tested this, uh, this tent to withstand a force 9 on the Beaufort scale. So bad weather isn't an issue for this tent. You're going to be nice and dry. And of course, the tent is going to be stable in those high winds as well. Some other features then, we have reflective points throughout the tent. So in the dark, if you have a head torch or a torch, these are going to light up. You're going to be able to see these nice and clearly. We then have our luminous guy lines all the way around the tent as well, hopefully ensuring that you're not going to trip over them quite as easily. Then we have our guy line retainers um, just on all of the guy lines throughout the tent. So when it comes to packing the tent down, we can simply wrap these guy lines up and pop them into these loops here so that the next time we come to use the tent or come to pitch the tent, they're easily accessible. We also supply you with our easy pegging system. So that's where we have three separate types of pegs that come with the tent. Uh, so we have these solid steel pegs here, which are for the corners of the tent. And these would go into the gray pegging points. We then have the black plastic pegs for all of the black pegging points throughout the tent. And we also have the luminous pegs here for the luminous guy lines, making it nice and easy for you to know that you're getting the right peg in the right place. So something else I just want to highlight on this tent here, quite a unique feature of it is this large uh, rain safe entrance or porch on the side here. You can see that this is going to give you really good shelter. If it is a little bit uh, wet, then obviously this is going to cover the entrance to the tent. And there's also a detachable ground sheet in this area too, um, which is bathtub in style. So you're going to get good protection, of course, completely waterproof as well. And obviously you have a full roll down waterproof door to cover that area as well. Also on the front of the tent, we have this large canopy which covers the front entrance. So again, if it's a little bit drizzly, then this is going to again protect this front door. The door itself is of a good size, nice and wide, um, so getting all of your kit in and out of the tent is going to be nice and simple. It's also quite a high uh, door as well, so it's a full walk-in tent. I mean, I'm quite tall and I can walk in and out of here, no problem at all. Inside the tent, there's certainly plenty of space. Uh, again, head height wise, uh, I can stand up fully in here. And as I said, I'm quite tall, about six foot three. And uh, as I say, yeah, I've got plenty of space here. Lots of floor space in the tent as well for uh, furniture and storage and things like this. I think that's uh, accentuated by these large windows all the way around the tent, each of which do have their own curtain. So if you do want a little bit more privacy, or um, if you want uh, slightly less sunlight coming into the tent, you can just see at the bottom here, we have a curtain which is rolled away, but that can be brought either halfway up or obviously fully closed as well. Just down this side here, on the opposite side of the rain safe, we have a uh, mesh ventilation panel, which does correspond to an outside panel on the tent. So if it gets a little bit too chilly, you can close that. A nice feature here at the front is that the front door has a full mesh door uh, rolled away here as well. So in terms of ventilation, uh, that's just rolled away here at the moment. Um, so you can drop that down, leaving the waterproof door up on the outside. 
and that is going to obviously going to give you great ventilation as well. And also on this side door, there's another full mesh door here, which is just zipped away at the moment. You can just see that in here. So actually you have great ventilation from the front and from the sides of the tent and at the back, which we'll show you shortly. You'll also find that at the front of the tent here, we have a full mesh door, which is just rolled away at the moment. And what that allows for is great ventilation within the tent. So something I mentioned earlier on is the name of the tent, which is the Montana 4E, and I'm sure you've been wondering what the E stands for. Well, it stands for our extended canopy system. So rolled away in this waterproof door, we have an extended canopy, and we'll just show you now how that works. So with the tent, we supply you with two upright steel poles, just like these ones here, and also a couple of guy lines to be used to fix the door into this sort of canopy position. Now, the extended canopy system actually just involves this piece of material that's already attached to the door and all we have to do is simply just unzip this down the sides and we can change this uh, position either to come straight down here just to give you a little bit more shade or shelter or we can also have it going out the front as a double length extended canopy. So here you can see that what we have created is a good sheltered and private area. Now with the use of two additional upright poles and two guy lines, we can now take this piece of material out, as I said earlier on, to create a double length extended canopy. So a feature that you won't be able to see from the angle that we're at here is a lantern hanging point just uh, in a central location here. Then we have cable tidies which run all the way down to where we have our cable entry point. So that's just this zip here that will just allow you to bring any electrics into the tent without having to have the, uh, the main door open. Uh, while I'm here as well, I'll highlight the, uh, the ground sheet. So I've already talked about the uh, outside ground sheet in the porch area. It's the exact same material as what we use on the inside. The only difference on the inside is that from front to back and side to side, uh, this ground sheet is fully sealed, as you can see, and it comes up at the edges here. So this is a bathtub style ground sheet. Now that's going to stop any drafts inside this area. It's going to keep out things like dirt and dust and sand. And more importantly, hopefully keep out those unwanted creepy crawlies as well. Uh, material wise, it's very tough and durable, totally waterproof with a hydrostatic head of 10,000 millimetres. At the back is where the bedrooms are. And as I mentioned earlier on, the tent can sleep up to four people. A nice feature of these bedrooms is that they come pre-attached. So the first time you pitch the tent, these are already in place. So that's a job that you don't need to worry about. The way that we uh, attach them to the fly sheet is using our wave-shaped hanging point system here. And whilst it has a certain element of design about it, it also has a function of just taking any stress off of that top seam of our bedrooms. Uh, plenty of features on the bedrooms themselves to talk about too. We have lots of storage pockets on the outside of the bedrooms. Then inside, you'll find that we have a large mesh ventilation panel at the back here, which corresponds to uh, panels on the fly sheet. We have these handy storage pockets in the bedrooms as well, ideal for smaller personal possessions. You find that the bedrooms are zipped uh, to separate them. If you want to, obviously, you can just unzip this and roll it away to allow you to have one large bedroom across the back, or of course you can separate it as we have done. And another great feature here is our universal inners, and we'll just show you now how that works. We have a few optional extras available for the tent, including a fleece carpet for the living area, just giving you a bit more comfort underfoot. We also have a footprint available, which you would put down first before pitching the tent, so that when you take the tent down, you're going to have a nice clean and dry uh, ground sheet for the tent itself. We also have a front extension available for the tent for those who might want a little bit more outside living space. 
So there you have it. That's all the features of the Montana 4E from our deluxe collection. Thanks very much for watching.